Welcome to the first Navin Android of 2024, your ongoing guide to what's new and notable in the world of Android development. In this episode, we'll cover Gemini Pro, Google AI SDK, Google AI Studio, Cast, Rust, and more. Following the announcement of developer access to the on-device multimodal Gemini Nano Foundation model, we introduced new ways for you to access the off-device Gemini Pro model, our best model for scaling across a wide range of text and image reasoning tasks. The Google AI Client SDK for Android, along with Google AI Studio, provides a simplified, streamlined way to integrate the Gemini Pro model, craft prompts, create API keys, and transform ideas into AI apps. Google Play will begin supporting more RMG apps this year, including game types and operators not covered by an existing licensing framework. This new approach will provide new business opportunities to developers globally while continuing to prioritize user safety. We'll launch this expanded RMG support in June to developers for their users in India, Mexico and Brazil, and plan to expand to users in more countries in future. We are launching new features that make it more seamless to cast on Android. The new output switcher makes it easy to move media between various devices as well as casting to devices nearby in a whole new way. There are a number of new features and improvements, including casting from short-form video apps, persistent cast icon, Shaka Player and more. Check out the article to learn more. In top 5 new features in Android Studio Hedgehog, Santiar summarizes changes we made to integrate Android Vitals data from the Google Play Console, the new Power Profiler, enhancements to the running devices window with support for physical device mirroring, the new UI, and updates to the SDK Upgrade Assistant. We have three new Android developer stories for you to check out. First, you can learn more about how Hoyaverse and Netmarble unlock the multilingual opportunity on Google Play. Next, you can check out how Z5 develops for multiple form factors in record time using Android developer resources like Jetpack Window Manager, Design Guidelines, Emulators, and more. Finally, you can learn more about Alvaro and how his SkyAlert app provides people with life-saving warnings for earthquakes. Unresponsive Android apps can be really frustrating for users, and when apps are unresponsive for too long, the system shows an application not responding error. We have a new page at developer.android.com on diagnosing and fixing ANRs. Check out the link to learn more about how to debug and determine the cause of ANRs. In Faster Rust Toolchains for Android, Chris covers how we work to ship the fastest version of the Rust toolchain that we can, leveraging multiple forms of profiling and optimization, as well as tuning C, C++, Linker, and Rust Flexed, tailored for the specific needs of the Android codebase. Next, Alex discussed how to increase your app's availability across device types by removing unnecessary feature requirements that prevent users from downloading your apps on devices that don't support the features. You can also learn more about how to automate tracking feature requirements and maximize app availability with badging. VR Play ended 2023 with stories covering a series of app founders in Indonesia, Singapore, Dubai, and Lisbon. Check out the links to read and learn more. We had several new alpha libraries launched in Android Jetpack. Hilt version 1.2.0 Alpha 1 adds overloaded Hilt View Model and Hilt Nav Graph View Models function for assisted injection support. Who doesn't like emojis? Emoji 2 version 150 Alpha 1 contains an updated emoji font to support Emoji 15.1 and also introduces some API changes. You can see all the Android X release notes in the description below. In Android Developers Backstage Episode 203, Tor, Roman, and Chad 
talk about some of the many things that happened this year in the world of Android development, including new device and form factors, tool improvements, Android X features and libraries, and Jetpack Compose releases. And since any tech podcast would be remiss without mentioning AI and ML, they talk about that too. That's it for this week with Gemini Pro, Google AI SDK, Google AI Studio, Real Money Games, Google Cast Updates, Developer Stories, Maximizing App Availability, Rust, and more. Check back soon for your next update from the Android Developer Universe.